Holy cow. Oh, military guys. Oh, a lot of military guys. Holy cow. There we go. Get some military gear going. We'll, we'll take that. All right. What's going on, guys? TDF Game. We are back in seven days to die. The single player season four playthrough. We're on day 37. We're getting all kinds of things done around the base. It's already 11 o'clock on the next day, day 37 here. We've gotten quite a bit done around the corner here. I've been trying to go around this entire thing and finish this up as best I can, throwing in some more of the uh, uh, corner pieces. We've got a few of those in. I've been digging out a little bit further this way and destroying a bunch of spikes. We've destroyed a whole bunch of spikes, which is kind of a bummer. I hate to destroy progress that we've made, but we really need to... Uh, do a couple things and actually I ran out of concrete so it's time to run below and get a little bit of concrete let's do that real quick and we'll go ahead and grab as much as we can off of here too let's take a bunch of this inside uh, but we've gotten quite a bit done we actually got quite a few visits uh, from screamers so we actually had a few in a row we actually had a few uh, uh, you know a few few headshots we had to perform this morning on the uh, screamer so that was that was kind of fun so I'll, I'll probably link that in right here Alright, looks like we got our wellness and stamina cap up to 167, so we're flying right there, heading towards 200 slowly. Uh, we want to make sure that we're getting uh, getting healed up in between here. We've been hitting our spikes constantly, so let me let me heal up just a little bit. Just need one of these here. That should heal us up enough right there. Uh, we've got all these going like crazy. Got to make sure they're constantly filled up. Let's do that right now. Throw a whole bunch of stone on here. Do this. And uh, that that should be plenty enough right there. Let's see. Make sure that's filled up. All right. Uh, no, not that one. This one here. We'll just go like this and this. And then on this one, same thing. All right. So that way that's constantly going there. We want to make sure that all the concrete in the world we have. Let's see. Get that going. There we go. So tons and tons of concrete going. Uh, over here we've got... A whole bunch of crushed sand coming along and then here of course we have our concrete mix so we've got quite a bit making up of that all right let's grab a little more from down here we'll grab about half a stack of that that should last us just a little bit upstairs all right so there you go there's there's the things that we need to get going right now I got a few more of the uh, oh you know what we need more of the ramps I believe is what we're gonna need oh we got a drop coming let's, let's figure out where it's headed to here in a second all right. Let's see if it shows us already. Is it right there inside of town? We may run and get that, especially we, we have a bike now, so we may definitely go over there and get that. All right. We need more of the ramp. Let's see, rebar frame ramp. So let's go with another 150 of that. All right, so we'll have that making up. Let's go ahead and make a quick trip on the uh, the bike over there and get this drop. Let's go check that out. And then we'll go, uh, there's actually another one that was out there too. We'll see if that one's still there. So we'll go get a couple drops. This bike will make this a whole lot easier. All right, here we go. Box number one. See what kind of madness we get out of this one. Should be a good drop. There we go. Definitely some good stuff. Get a little bit of ammunition resupply. A couple of little things like that. Definitely worthwhile. Uh, let's see, anything else that I got inside there? Oh, I can't look while we're on the bike. That's right. Okay. And there's one more that we want to look at over on the other side. So I'll meet you guys over there real quick. 
All right, there we go. There's the second drop up on top of this hill over here. Go ahead and grab all that right there. Perfect. There you go. This this bike is kind of a game changer for this. We're definitely able to come out here and get these things super fast. Really, really helpful. Uh, and actually, I guess since we're out here, let's let's just go ahead and take a little bit of trip. It's already 1300, so we can't go too far. Uh, but we can at least go out here and kind of check out what's out here. I see a house up on the hill. There's one way out there. I kind of want to see if this other uh, village is accessible over here. Let's kind of fly around this way. And we'll hopefully get back in time to do a little bit more building around the base. But it's, if we don't, it's fine. We want to make sure we're still adventuring some. We don't want to do just base builds here. We want to do a little bit of everything. There are going to be some, ep some episodes where we're kind of stuck doing you know, nothing but building and nothing but digging. You know, the grind. This is definitely one of those games you got to do a lot of grinding. But we're having a lot of fun with it so far. We haven't had uh, too many days where we've you know, found ourselves do nothing but digging or nothing but uh, building. Uh, but even if we do, it's not such a bad thing. All right, let's see. What do we got up here? So there's that little... That's what I want to see. I want to see this place over there. kind of want to check out these two little towns here. I uh, wouldn't be too upset if we found a trader also. would be nice to hit up a trader real quick, but I'm not seeing anything like that. Okay. Looks like this... Uh, Looks like this road right here goes straight across the river. That's perfect. So we can cut across. It looks like it's in a desert area. That's too bad. But we're going to check this out over here for sure. I definitely want to see this this place. You can see it's got a really cool tower I would like to check out. We won't do the tower today, but at least we know what's over here. That would be one of those ones where we have to plan it out uh, really well ahead of time where we get up right away. First thing, as soon as uh, sunlight comes up, we head this way. All right. Let's uh see what we got here. Oh, I like this. This is a pretty cool looking little town right here. Let's go in here. Okay. Navis Gain Survivors. Okay, so it's got a, a sign almost like it's one of the regular towns. That's interesting. Okay. All right, let's kind of head out this way over here. Nothing. A whole bunch of houses. That building right there looks really interesting with the satellite dish on top of it. Let's go up there and check that out. All right. All right. Looks like they got a uh, Joe Bro builder over here as well. So that's awesome. About this looks looks the same as the one we have. So no no difference there. Oh, look, this is different. The Brother Theater. Okay. So they have a different theater. I've never seen that one before. Uh, and then this this tower is kind of what we're interested in right here. What is this? Definitely got some holes in it, whatever it is. Uh, there's another adult movie theater. Alright, so this might be the same tower we have in our town. Just has a little bit different uh, structure on the back of it. That's really weird. Yeah, so that is the same tower. It's just kind of tore up on the back side. Alright, so now we know what that is. This one here. Let's see what this one is. Is this the bookstore? This may be the bookstore. Looking very similar to the one we have. Yep, okay, so there's the Cracker Book. We, you know, we love that store. That's definitely one of those ones that's nice to go into and get some good levels. All right, Post Office. Okay, Post Office sounds like a good idea. All right, let's check out the Post Office. This may be a little bit crazy in here, but we definitely need to check it out. All right. Oh, nice, we got a wrench out of that. That's actually what we needed. All right, so let's do this. Let's uh, store a bunch of this. So go like this. Do I need anything? No, I don't right now. Uh, we're going to keep one first aid on us just in case. Uh, we got a mini bike seat. Nice. Okay. Yeah, I did all kinds of stuff in here. So let's go ahead and place another nail gun. Nice. We're going to place pretty much all of this over here. All right. Like so. All right. Let's go ahead and take this off. Our guy's overheated like crazy. All right. Let's go inside the... Uh, post office hopefully this isn't just complete madness in here we'll have to see I've had some bad experiences uh, in new buildings lately so we'll see what this is like all right here we go all right sneak in here in front of the post office you know anytime you go into a federal building you're gonna have issues or are those searchable I'm not sure Let's see, are these are these something you can search? Nope. Okay, they're not. They're just decorative. Alright. 
started a little quieter than I would like. Okay. Oh, we got a safe. Huh. I don't know if this is the issue where the zombies just haven't built in yet. That's really weird. Alright, let's break into the safe. Definitely make this worthwhile if we get something good out of this. Alright. Got a couple things in there. Glass pane, no thanks. I'll scrap that in a second. So a bunch of this stuff we're going to scrap. I'm just grabbing real quick. And we're getting a little, little worried about the fact that Oh, look at this. These guys got their own TV at their desk. Nice. Other than the fact that they died, they got a good job. All right. Check these last couple here. All right. Nothing in here so far. So definitely interesting. Oh, they each have their own safe. No way. Okay. Might be able to get some good things out of this. Let's check these real quick. All right. A little bit of something there. Oh, we leveled up again. That's awesome. Alright, nothing sneaking up on me. Alright, keep cracking this open. I like that there's already a couple of small safes here. That's perfect. Alright, nothing there. So that was kind of a bust. Alright, last one. Let's check this one. Give me something good. Something good, something good. Come on, come on. Alright, well, there's some parts I guess we'll take. All right, let's see. Oh, oh, man, there's one on each one of this. So give me just a second to break these open, and we'll see if there's any good in any of them. All right, I'm going to check all of them at once here. I'm going to check them real quick. I did see something new that I haven't seen before. I'll we'll have to see what that is. All right, compound bow schematic. I think we can scrap that one. We can scrap that, and we can scrap that. Chainsaw schematic we can scrap. Uh, we found a gold nugget. We found two gold nuggets and two silver nuggets. I've never actually found those before. That's actually completely new to me. So we'll definitely have to check that out. Let's scrap all this stuff here. Scrap. Scrap. Drop that junk. All right. Uh, we may keep the shotgun so we can combine it with ours. We'll scrap. And I need... I can't remember if I need long barrels or short barrels for the turrets. We'll have to see what we need there. But there you go. Gold and silver nuggets. Definitely never found that before. That's really cool. Alright. Let's go down here since we're pressing our luck already. Okay. Alright. I hear something. Might have just been a uh, vulture. Okay. Interesting. So we got another, uh, another little wall safe down here. We'll definitely check that. All right, let's keep sneaking this way here. And another safe. We got two more safes in here. Still no no zombies, which is actually a little scary. All right, let's uh let's break in. Hopefully our our pick doesn't break. We're getting a little low on our pick. There we go. Break this guy open. We'll break the big one open, then we'll go for the smaller two. All right, definitely a shotgun short barrel, just in case that's what we need. All right, pistol receiver, no, pistol barrel, no, and shotgun shells. Yeah, we'll take those. All right, perfect. Oh, we can combine that. All right, we got a couple more here. These wall safes. So post office is definitely, definitely worthwhile. Really nervous. Super dark and scary down here. And we're in the desert, so that doesn't help. All right, hunting rifle receiver. A little bit of paint. We definitely need paint. Oh, some LED goggles, okay. And a leather duster we can combine with our own to get close to 600. Alright. Alright, let's go. Do we got enough to break into a couple more safes with this pickaxe? Last a little longer for me. There we go. Alright. Hunting rifle parts. Shotgun short stock. Alright. I think there was one more. Yeah, see, I hear that. There's definitely... Some craziness going on out there. Alright, we got one more wall safe here. Alright, let's get this broke open. Alright, there we go. And bam, perfect. Okay. Uh, we will take you. We will take you and take you. Perfect. Alright. Make sure our club is out just in case. Okay. 
I guess we should investigate just a little further here. Okay. So nothing there. We're hurting temperature wise though. Is there no staircase to get up there? Or is this like just an empty? Now there should be one more set of doors somewhere. Yeah, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe this is it. Maybe there's no other uh no other direction you can go from here. Okay. I thought maybe there'd be something up there. I guess not. Let's go ahead and bust out the door. Alright, we went ahead and got back to base, put a bunch of stuff in our little random box that we'll organize out tonight. Oh, we got some bookshelves. I'm going to put those in just a second. We wanted to combine these real quick. There we go, 565. So start starting to get up there. Uh, but we, we got a pretty good haul. The gold and silver nuggets is going to be a big deal. We got some more ammo, which we definitely needed a little bit of refill there. Uh, we've been going a little bit nuts with the sniper, ri uh, sniper rifle, so we definitely need to get a little bit of a refill on the ammo, so we're good there. All right, let's grab the rest of the stuff off this bike here so before we close it in. All right, let's go like so, like so. I'm going to grab all this stuff. All right, there we go. Perfect. All right, let's close this guy in here. Like so. And, and I'll think of some kind of better, like a better system for it to actually keep it safe. Maybe like a, a drawbridge or something like that to where it can, you know, actually shut in a little bit. So we'll definitely try that. But for right now, this this works out for us. Uh, I think there's no issue with it, but we want to make sure we keep it parked up on a platform like this. That way it doesn't sink into the ground. We've seen a few glitches where it, you know, sinks down to the ground, so we've got to watch out for that. Let's run in place this last couple of things here. All right, open this guy up. We'll run down here, do this real quick, maybe place these bookshelves. Uh, we definitely need to place those. All right, come on. Right over... Here, throw this. All right, throw that, 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 that. We'll keep that. See, there's another ammo supply box. I want to see how many of those we have. All right, this guy we can go ahead and scrap. Uh, another nail gun. That's actually pretty cool. I don't know if I can combine these two. I'll have to see if that's something that we can combine. Hmm. No, it's an assemble thing. Ah, okay. So we actually have to assemble it. So we might we may combine real quick stuff together. All right. Oh, let's place the rest of these uh, read that there we go now we know how to do the rocket launcher that's good all right place these last couple things up there all right let's do a quick combining of these guys here so let's do that over here all right this should upgrade a little bit I don't know what the point of upgrading the nail gun is if it's really worth it but we, we might as well keep our durability up I guess all right receiver nail gun parts and rechargeable battery very cool alright and then this side same thing like so and bam alright do a quick quick set of combining kinda see what we come out with here it may not be a, a huge difference in fact it's not gonna be any it's just gonna repla repair some of the durability okay so we're not gonna improve it at all okay hmm wonder if that's an issue with, I don't know, I wonder if I need to level something else up. I'm not 100% sure now. All right, put that back together. All right, so that's good. Now let's see how many how many rounds we have now. I want to kind of check this situation out. So, you know what, we have way more than I thought. We got 12 here plus 4 here, so I can start kind of using some of these for shotgun shells and some of them to keep our uh, 7.62 ammo up, which isn't doing horrible, but... We can definitely use some more here. All right, let's let's go check out what we can get done. It's already 1800, so we got to kind of hurry up here. Uh, see how much more we can get done around the little uh, platform base here. And we're just doing that because we want to make sure that this is going to be our main fallback spot in case some of the other ideas we have don't work. So we need this one to be up to standard to where we actually need it, not just you know kind of haphazard thrown together the way we kind of did. Man, we're hitting all of our spikes. I guess that's one way to get rid of the spikes. All right, we want to check out this side over here. Make sure this this gets done up here. All right. Go ahead and concrete this whole side here. And then we need to do... Oh, I hate to destroy most of this, but we need to go ahead and destroy most of these spikes. Uh, so we need to do a little bit of digging underneath. Sometimes if we dig underneath, it'll automatically break those, but I'm not sure if that'll work today. Let's, let's try it out. All right. We need to 
yeah there we go that's perfect so that helps us out that makes that a little easier all right and we need to go one row this way and I think this would be the last row I'm not even sure we have to double check all right there we go perfect oh I didn't mean for it to fall that far but that's fine that works all right that one's not gonna break that one we're gonna have to break our own here We have a hard time breaking these sometimes too. Not sure where to hit. There we go. There we go. All right. Okay. Can't seem to get through. Oh, there's a, a little phantom piece in the air there. There we go. All right. Finish taking the rest of this out. All right. Give me a few minutes to break these out. And we'll kind of see how this how this looks once we get it done. All right, we've got quite a bit done. I'm, I'm placing them all the way around the edges here. Uh, we've got a full row done all the way around to the other side. Uh, we still got way more work to do on each side. Down here is going to be barbed wire, like we've talked about in the past. Uh, it's going to take a little bit of time to do, too. I'm going to start making some of that up uh, during the nighttime here. Uh, but you can kind of see we've dug underneath here. Uh, eventually, the ground right here is going to be evened out quite a ways out, so that way uh, we're not going to do so much work. If we would, if we would have picked a little bit better flat spot, this would have been a little bit easier, but... Uh, this is not the best uh, flat area for this. In fact, we probably should have built, if we really would have thought about it, we could have built on the road. That would actually help out in some areas. Uh, we could have built on top of there and then been digging on the outside of the roads. Oh, you know what, though? We would have had to dig through some of the road. I don't know if that had been uh, in this area. That would have been kind of a pain. So not such a bad thing. i got to clear out a few more spikes on this side, but we're kind of hesitant to get rid of all the spikes because we still need some kind of defense uh, while we're you know digging so we're not getting... Uh, snuck up on while we're standing around with a shovel in our hand so uh, let me go around one time upgrade all these real quick so that way when we come out in the morning they'll all be good to go all the way out here like so and we'll do the same thing on this other other two sides real quick that way like I said they'll be good to go when we come out the next day so we don't have to worry about them uh, and this just makes them a lot tougher so that way if something did come out here they wouldn't be getting tore up but let's go all the way to the end here. All right. There we go. And kind of gives us an idea. We want to keep going with this so that way we know how much concrete we're going to actually be using. Let's right, see if I can actually do this from up here. And you can see where the ground's going to all get destroyed here eventually. Uh, we're going to have to dig all this out. All these spikes are going to have to go, uh, which is kind of a bummer. Oh, there's one of our friends. Of course, of course it's about time for her. There we go. Oh, she brought some big friends. Okay. All right. I know the spider's got to be close. Where's the spider at? Oh, he blew up. Okay. Oh, we got another screamer. Where? There we go. So she got another scream off. We're going to have more friends coming. Uh, where do they come from? Did she get a scream off? I thought she did. Maybe they got lost. Oh. There we go. I knew we get a headshot on that one. Alright, so there we go. Get a little bit of a little more uh screamer action at the end of the day here. They haven't been too bad. Like usually about this time we're getting just con constantly bombarded and it hasn't been that bad, so we'll we'll take a little bit of uh, a little bit of trouble here and there. Oh, we didn't get him. There we go. There's one here too. Where'd he go? There we go. I don't know if we actually took the other guy out. Let's make sure we search these bodies that got taken out over here. And then that's pretty much going to do it for today. I think we're going to have to uh, call it a day, go down in, inside, and actually get a couple things done inside the base, see what we can get done uh, through the night, get a little more iron going. I need to make sure that I have a lot of rebar frames. That's going to be one of our areas that we're going to have to really step up on. Uh, I'm really surprised that the, that was all that came from those two screamers. Usually it's more than that. All right, guys. That's definitely going to do it for today. So make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next episode of 7 Days to Die, single player season 4 playthrough. All right, guys. Have a great day. Oh, we got like a horde or something outside. Let's, let's go out here and check this out. Holy cow. Oh, military guys. Oh, a lot of military guys. Holy cow. There we go. Get some military gear going. We'll, we'll take that. All right. Oh, and some radiated guys. All right, all kinds of friends. That's what I'm talking about. Let's do this. Oh, hit him.
There we go. Okay. Let's get a headshot on this guy. There we go. There's some of their radiated buddies. We we're kind of wondering where some of these really good hordes have been. Oh, they're on the door. And that's why we have an awesome metal door. Oh, reload, reload. Come on. Oh, a feral. There's our feral, buddy. All right, very cool. I still hear one or two more. Uh, let's see. They might be, maybe they're stuck on that backside. Let's see. There they are. <laughs> that one last guy. There we go. A little, bit of, a little bit of soldier fun real quick before we end the episode. That'll definitely work. All right, guys. Now, have a great day.